Good morning. Well, thank you everyone for coming and welcome uh, for those of you that are uh, here just for this event, welcome to Omaha's Henry Dorley Zoo and Aquarium. We are thrilled to have you. Uh, we were nominated for all three categories of USA Today 10 Best Reader's Choice Awards. We were nominated as Best Safari Park, Best Zoo Exhibit, and Best Zoo in the United States. So first of all, uh, we want to thank USA Today's panel of experts for the nomination. We are honored and humbled to stand amongst truly some of the greatest uh, zoos in the United States. Um, most of them are our peers and friends, if not all of them. And we love that this voting opportunity provides a forum uh, for people to really express their opinions and their support when it comes to the zoos that they are so passionate about and to celebrate the quality of programs and the work that we do for animals and wild places every day. I also want to say thank you to our community that took the time to vote and to show the support. Thank you, thank you to every one of you. And without much further ado, I'd like to announce the final standings for each category. First of all, we were nominated for Best Safari Park and we are the number one safari park in the nation. This year, our Desert Dome was nominated for the best Sioux exhibit, and we are the number one Sioux exhibit in the nation. Last year, we got the honor of being the number one zoo in the United States. And once again, we were nominated for best zoo in the United States. And we are the number one zoo in the nation. Of course, we are extremely proud to have swept all three categories once again. And I want to pause because this is not only a huge, zoo, uh, a huge recognition for our zoo, but a big win for Omaha and for our entire community. This means so much to us, but also so much to Omaha and the recognition that this brings to our zoo and our community. With that, I'd like to welcome our friend and colleague, Deb Ward, uh, Executive Director of Visit Omaha, to say a few words. Well, congratulations once again for sweeping the USA Today categories. I think the zoo and Oppenheimer are taking home all the awards this season. Uh, research tells us that one of the main reasons families actually visit Omaha is, of course, because of the zoo. So you all have been number one in our books for quite some time. But getting national attention from USA Today helps tell our story to a national and maybe a world audience and inspires even more people to visit. The zoo is just that gift that keeps on giving. Uh, the zoo is featured in most of our advertising that we use in Kansas City, Des Moines, Sioux Falls, Minneapolis, and Chicago. And we have seen a 5% increase in visitation from those cities year over year. And of course, the zoo plays a big part in those numbers. And out-of-town visitors play a big part in the zoo's attendance numbers. In 2023, our research shows 42% of the people who came to the zoo came from over 60 miles away. Those people are staying in our hotels, eating in our restaurant, shopping in our stores, paying our taxes, which helps sell the city services. And don't forget, tourism supports more than 15,000 jobs for our friends, families, and neighbors here in in Omaha. So in addition to the zoo being just a wonderful place to bring your family, you can also feel good that you're helping the uh, Omaha job market as well. So simply put, Omaha Zoo is the goat. So congratulations. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, thank you, Deb, for those very kind words. And thank you to our entire team members, paid and unpaid, volunteers and staff members. You are truly the reason we are number one and the community recognizes your work in their voting and their support. Of course, thank you to our community that supported and voted for us, not only here in Omaha, but across the world, who let us know that they were voting and voting every day. And we hope to see you in person once again. We are very proud to be your number one zoo, number one safari park, and to feature the best zoo exhibit in the United States once again. Thank you very much. Let's celebrate. <laughs>